So I loaded up Tarkov the other day. It was the first time I ever played the game, because I uh, just recently built my PC. But, me being a new player to the game, there's this huge learning curve. And uh, upon my research of what I need to know, the survival skills that I need to know in order to survive this communist hellscape that is Escape from Tarkov. I'm trying to crush every morsel of will out of my body and steal every ruble from my pocket. And uh, let's just say what I've learned is that Tarkov, Tarkov giveth and Tarkov taketh away very punishing game but when it rewards oh it rewards seeing that number in your stash the amount of rubles that you have slowly increase well that just gets me off uh, but uh this is the ups and downs of Tarkov well mostly downs anyway <laughs> oh and um all the music in this video is made by your best friend, Jippy. Super cool guy. Check him out. I'm a big fan of cartoons myself. Yes, yeah, so I uh, actually started watching Regular Show and Adventure Time recently again because those shows are always, always kind of fun to watch. But uh, it kind of reminds me of, uh, you know, like the characters that you play as in Tarkov or whatever. Uh, like the bears and the scabs. They kind of remind me of that one guy from uh, Bugs Bunny. What's his name? Like uh, Elmer Fudd. That's what it was. Yeah. It kind of reminds me if Elmer Fudd had decided to like retire from hunting and take up uh, smoking crack in the basement instead. <laughs> like. <laughs> Like, completely disassociates himself from his family. Uh, hasn't seen the light of day in six months. Just been smoking crack in a derelict basement. I don't know. This is what I see when I look at that guy. But, uh, anyway, back to the task at hand. Oh, no, it's not. What the hell? Just leave circuit boards and shit? Okay. Did they just, like, read all this and, like, fuck off? Alright, 40,000. Okay. Hold up. I might just want to hop out if I have 47,000 rubles on me. Uh, yeah, I'm really poor. <laughs> if you can't tell. But part of me also just wants to keep looting. Because I'm a grimy little fuck and I need as much money as I can get. I don't actually know if there's any loot in those sniper towers, by the way. Oh fuck, I'm taking that. Are you kidding me? I don't really know how looting works in this game, so if anyone has a problem, they can uh they can fuck up. You see, the thing about me playing this game is that I'm a rat who doesn't really want to be a rat. I guess no rat really wants to be a rat. But I will say that uh, most of the games that I've played, I've 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 been pretty rat-like. I've been scurrying around just barely scraping by every time and I don't want to do that anymore so most of the time when I get a rat win I guess 
I didn't really consider them as victories. It was more as of just like a, uh, I barely survived kind of deal. You know, I'm only doing this so that I can afford another run next round. But I want to make, like, you know, some good loot. You know, I want to get out with some, like, delicious succulent loot that I can savor and, like, destroy some children with. Make their families cry when they go to their funeral, you know? And, uh... <laughs> yeah. When I get a rat win, it doesn't really feel like that much. Very much. Is that a dude? No, it's just a bush. How the fuck would they make a bush look like that from the distance? Jesus, dude, this is tired. Just like fucking heart attack after heart attack. Okay, I'm almost there. Stamina build up, then we're gonna sprint. Hope to God no one sees us. I'm just kick cover behind the pipes. That's the plan. That was profitable, to say the least, boys. The rat wins again. And now for uh, believe it or not, different. most of the runs that I do in Tarkov are not that smooth, actually. Um, I know I was talking about how I want to get into more fights and get more loot, but um, the majority of fights that I get into uh, usually end in uh, at least one death most of the time is being me more like all of the time <laughs> but uh yeah if you want to see what it, it it's really like playing Tarkov with me uh here you go God, I thought that was the other door. Shit. And now for something completely different. We're going to go get the uh, bronze uh, watch for Propor. So, see how it goes. Oh, it's pitch fucking black. Okay, cool. to just sprint out and shoot is uh, tempting. How am I draining so much stamina so quickly?
shit, I got two kills. <laughs> and did the task or whatever I'm supposed to do. Hopefully I can actually get out though. Ow, fuck, I'm retarded. <laughs> Also, I thought that gun was on full auto, I guess not. I don't remember where this is. Oh, that was a headshot. Holy shit. It's over there. Wait, the, what? The light? No, the door is closed. Shit. So, me finding out that the door was closed resulted in me having to find another way to leave. Now, I'm not one to know very much of this map, so I had to look it up, and that's why it took me 20 years to edit this video, because I had to chop out a thousand hours of me uh, looking up tutorials and how to do things. <laughs> but, um, I found my way to the old gas station. And this is where I finally felt the first victory I've ever had in Escape from Tarka. My first true victory. All my other victories were all rat wins, so I guess those don't really count now. Yes! Oh my god! I did it! I actually fucking did it! Oh my god! Yes! Oh, that feels... You have any idea how good that feels to just... Have a smooth... A smooth run like that. Yeah, so... I got better at Tarkov. I'd like to believe, anyway. Uh, I've been getting a lot more kills ever since I got that first win. I actually started enjoying the game. And, to me, when I started, when I started playing Tarkov, it... It kind of reminded me of that one torture scene from Reservoir Dogs, where you're just the dude in the chair, scared out of your mind, and just begging to God that you don't die in a raid. And Tarkov is the dude with the gas canister singing and dancing and making fun of you while he bites off your ear. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I definitely do feel like as the game progresses, uh, you get better game, obviously, and, uh, yeah, so did I. So here's a couple clips of me murdering people in cold blood, just to prove a point. <laughs> He's gonna get away! Not if I can help it! As a matter of fact, yes. Oh, shit! A rat!
Oh no! Well, uh, <laughs> I could probably use a little bit more practice. <laughs> it's such a pain to be alone and lonely.